we fly through the night, I can't help but ponder. Intelligence, reason, even simple thought. Most people take these things for granted. I do not. For I know what it's like to be an advanced mind, trapped in the body of a brute, of a monster. But for once, I am not the monster in question. My friend Donatello is one of the gentlest souls I've ever met, with one of the finest minds I've ever known. But now, thanks to the evil Agent Bishop, my friend has been transformed into a thoughtless savage, and I fear the Donatello I know may truly be lost forever. This is unacceptable. Your progress on the outbreak cure is lacking, Doctor. The situation in the city is getting worse, and it's keeping my attention away from my work. Your work? Please! The original outbreak virus was an unintended side effect of the genetic accelerants I created for you. There are too many variables. I'm testing dozens of retroviruses. Sir, pardon the interruption. There's a transmission coming in. We can't trace the signal. It's... What kind of signal? We've never seen anything like it, sir. It's coming in on our dedicated frequency. Sir, they want to talk to you. I'll take it in the comm room. Comm systems activate. Open secure line. Authorization Bishop Omega 102. Greetings, Agent Bishop. How did you get access to this frequency? How do you know my name? We have been watching you, John Bishop. We know of your abduction by aliens so long ago. We know all. Who are you? You watch the skies night after night looking for your little green men. Little gray men, actually. Futilely gathering what technology you can in hopes of staving off invasion. But right under your nose is everything you need. Information that would put you centuries ahead in your work. And I'm to believe you're just going to give me this information? No, but I can help you get it. For a price. It will be worth it. There is an ancient gemstone encoded with thousands of intricate designs for very advanced alien technology. And I believe you're familiar with the organization that holds it. They are called... The Foot. Despair, my son. Where there is life, there is hope. 
I keep turning to ask Don what we're gonna do, to see what brilliant cure he's worked up to fix this. But then I remember, that is Don. I too wish to consult with Donatello regarding his condition. He did the majority of the work on the outbreak virus. Without him, I fear my progress is too slow. Donatello's condition grows worse by the minute. The outbreak strain is reacting violently with the Utrom mutagen in his blood. His cells are breaking down. It's only a matter of time before he is lost forever. That's not gonna happen. We can't let that happen. Every problem has a solution. Every question an answer. Perhaps we are asking the wrong questions. Donatello told me this outbreak was artificial, that Agent Bishop created it. And if Bishop created it, maybe he can uncreate it. Bishop is a dangerous man, Leonardo. I know, but we may not have a choice, especially if Donnie's running out of time. Rest easy, Don. We're gonna find a way to help you. It's your favorite, Donnie. When you wake up, you can... within this form. Hear my voice. You do not want to hurt your brother. Relax, let go. Let go, my son. That's right. resistant to the gas. I will have to work on stronger tranquilizers. I just wanted to give him some food. That settles it. We're going after Bishop. We'll make him help Don. And how exactly are we gonna find him? Last I checked, he wasn't listed in the Yellow Pages. I know where he is. Remember, he held me for weeks, torturing me. I vowed to catch up to him again someday and even the score. But the journey is long. I fear Donatello doesn't have that much time. Hmm. Maybe Donnie can help us with that. This is the last thing Don was working on before. Before. He completely overhauled Stockman's helicopter. It should get us where we need to go fast enough. has need of you. <laughs> Our master is the Shredder, not you, little girl. You are nothing but a pretender, like the Udram Abomination before you. You forget your place, Mystics. You serve me now. I hold the same power over you that my father did. All your talk of ancient power. You live in the past. I am the future and you will obey me. 
Find the turtle, Leonardo. He must pay for his crimes against my father. Do you hear me? Find him! Perhaps he will find you. This is it. Groom Lake, Nevada. Prep for landing. Wait a minute. Groom Lake? As an Area 51? Take it easy, laughing boy. Eep. Area 51. This can't be right. Maybe this isn't Bishop's base. Maybe we took a wrong turn. At Albuquerque? This is where Bishop's base is located. But Area 51? All those crazy stories. It's... it's the heart of darkness! UFO Central! The nexus of weirdness! Then you'll fit right in. Weird or not, we're going in there. Straight infiltration. Raph, Mikey, and I get in and get Bishop. Master Splinter and Leatherhead will stay with Don just in case. Once we have Bishop, we'll convince him to help Don. Leatherhead and I can handle that portion of the plan. We can be very convincing. No mistakes. This is a military base. Special Ops. Bishop's turf. Be ready for anything. Split up and scout the perimeter. Let's see what we're up against. Guys! Okay. You got me. I wasn't expecting this. The place is deserted. I'm telling you, Area 51 is bad news. Aliens check in, but they don't check out. Stifle it, Mikey. I'm warning you. Bishop. <laughs> Welcome, turtles. I must say, I'm surprised to see you. We don't get a lot of guests here. Oh, I knew this was too easy. You think they saw the copter? It's Area 51. They probably have a UFO watching us from space. Not exactly, Michelangelo. We detected the helicopter as it approached because it's my helicopter. Dr. Stockman took it to New York on his ill-fated trip. Stockman? Still alive? I thought we were done with you for good. Oh, I wish. But Agent Bishop didn't see fit to let me rest in peace. Enough chit-chat. What brings you turtles to my house? There's been an outbreak in New York caused by your alien invasion force. I'm familiar with the situation in New York. Don got infected. He's been transformed into... into a monster. <laughs> oh, that's rich. So much for the smart one. Perhaps we can be of aid to one another. What if I told you I could cure your brother? Why would you help us? I would help your brother because I require something from you in exchange. There is no way we should make a deal with this guy. Don's in trouble because of Bishop. And he tried to dissect us, remember? It may be a deal with the devil, but what choice do we have?
where did you get this pathetic containment unit? In a junkyard? Amateurs. Ready the cell for transfer. Doctor, is this transfer necessary? It is if you want more than his blood pressure and temperature. Now open that hunk of junk. Stockman! Don, don't! Look at that! Crud. Good one, Stockman! Enforcements immediately. Modify mission objective. Subdue the beast. Don, hang on. Donatello, please be calm, my son. Sorry, Master, but I didn't think that was going to work a second time. Bishop, no! Don't hurt him! If your brother cannot be contained, then he will be put down! I had hoped we could do business together, but it seems I was wrong. My friend, if he must be subdued, then I will do it, not you, fiend. Leonardo, get the tranquilizers! This is Bishop to command. Send in two more squads. Lethal force is authorized. Stop! Just wait. Just give me five minutes. You have two. I'm sorry, but this is for your own good. It's gonna be all right, Donnie. Donatello's body appears to be breaking down at a fantastic rate due to secondary stage mutations caused by the outbreak accelerant. He doesn't have much time. The animal was right. <sighs> Leonardo, this is wrong. We cannot leave Donatello's fate to these devils. Stockman cannot be trusted. And him, if you only knew what he was capable of. <sighs> Leatherhead's right, Leo. Bishop's the enemy! He's the one that caused the outbreak in the first place! Stockman created the genetic accelerant on my orders. What you call the outbreak virus is an unintended side effect of one of my operations. Do you have a cure?
yes. But as I said earlier, I need something from you. <sighs> Name it. A simple errand, really. There is an item I require. A relic that may prove crucial to my work. I want you to retrieve it for me. Retrieve it? From where? New York. In fact, I believe you know the woman who currently holds it. Her name is Karai.